November 11, 2022, will be the 100th anniversary of the birth of Kurt Vonnegut, author of Slaughterhouse-Five, Breakfast of Champions, Cat's Cradle, and many other novels. In our November-December issue, to mark his centenary, we're publishing a short story that was found among the author's files after his death in 2007. It's called Confido, and it's the first new Kurt Vonnegut story to appear in the Post in decades. Our next issue also tells the story of Chef Jose Andres. Born in Spain, this culinary master came to America when he was 21 years old and quickly built a restaurant empire. But after an earthquake in 2010 devastated Haiti, Andres traveled to the island nation to see how he could help, and it gave him a new perspective and a new goal in life. He had mastered providing delicious food for the few. Now he was going to concentrate on feeding the many. Today, his organization, the World Central Kitchen, is often one of the first groups to arrive after a disaster hits. Unfettered by government bureaucracy, the World Central Kitchen races anywhere in the world to the scenes of hurricanes, earthquakes, tornadoes, and other disasters to work with local communities and make sure people can find healthy, free meals while they recover. As our final issue of the year, this is also our holiday issue, and you'll find no shortage of holiday-related stories inside. You'll read All in the Family, in which Philip Gully rejoices in not hosting this year's family Thanksgiving. You'll also find an interview with Tim Allen, whose new Disney Plus series, The Santa Clauses, has him excited about fat suits, family, and faith. Our holiday travel gift guide can help you find the perfect present for your favorite globetrotter. And to cap off the new year, Cable Newhouse expounds on the over-the-top merrymaking that accompanies New Year's Eve parties, which he says is practically a new global sport. And America is winning, if you could call it that. All this, plus model railroading, responsible fashion, the year of two Thanksgivings, health updates, book recommendations, and more, coming soon in the November-December 2022 issue of the Saturday Evening Post.